Hopefully we've saved this chicken from being murdered inside that chicken cage because they do not like sick chickens and chickens do not like injured chickens. They will finish the job. All right, so Beverly came out and saw that we have a rooster that's bleeding. I looked out of the window and they actually started attacking it, which is our biggest rooster. So we're gonna try to get it out of there for a couple of days. Hopefully get that cleaned off and see what it is. So in Louisiana, you can catch a chicken. Oh, you can catch a chicken. Go to work. Whoa, don't come by me. Get trouble with y'all. All you want to do is get it over his head. Good, good. Drop it, drop it, drop it. Just drop it on top of it. Huh? Put it on the side of just put it over him and drop it on the ground. Right there. Go ahead. Good. Keep it down. Flip it over. Nope. Are you over a minute. You over a minute. Drop it. Flip it. Flip it. Flip it. Good. Good. Up. 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 Good. You have it? Yeah. How much you weigh? I don't know. I'm about to break this thing. Uh oh, what are you gonna break it? Go ahead. All right. Let's close this up. Take them all to that uh to the nursery. All right. So we're taking them to the hospital. Hold it up a little bit. Let's let's take a look at. Oh, it's heavy, huh? Right here, we get the skin. So we see that he's bleeding on the back of his head. We don't really know if something maybe tried to stick it, get him through the cage or what. Uh, we we'll try to get him cleaned off a little bit. And there you go, hold that part. I'll hold this other side. All right. Has a chicken. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> With a much rather to eat him while he was healthy, but we don't know what's wrong with him now, so we'll get him close to here. See if we can get him to walk up in here. Go ahead and get on out of here. Wrong place. Get in there. All right, so we'll try to figure out, uh, at least this will keep the other chickens from pecking them. Uh, we but were, bugs. yeah, but those chickens were like pecking, crazy pecking at his head, which was probably making it bleed more. So we'll, we'll probably bring him inside at night because we got a coyote or a wolf or something that's yeah. kind of around here that's may have some kind of way we can't see it away but maybe some kind of way something has gotten and scratched them in top of the head so we'll let them heal up for a few days hopefully and then we'll put them back in all right so thank y'all for watching that hopefully we've saved this chicken from being murdered inside that chicken cage because they do not like sick chickens and chickens do not like injured chickens they will finish the job uh, so hopefully he's going to do better in here. You feel better? You miss your friends, huh? I'll go over there and put you close to him, but we can't put you inside that cage, okay? All right. So let's bring that cage over there and just sit it inside that chicken cage outside of it, though. Here you go. We're going to bring you back. <laughs> so they're all talking to one another. Uh, we like to keep them at least acquainted with one another. Uh, knowing each other so we won't, we won't be like a new bird coming in once we put them back in they miss him already though but they just can't help it the instincts are to peck at 
that red spot on top of his head with that blood coming out. So at least now that he'll have a chance to heal up guys and he'll be back in there in a minute. Alright, thank y'all for watching our channel. Thank y'all for checking us out. Uh, if you can help us in the comments below, help us out. <laughs> Tell us what you think happened to this chicken. Or what could have happened. They don't fight. Now we've never had a fighting problem. We have three roosters in here. We've never had a fighting problem. So maybe we, I don't know, maybe they're starting to fight. Uh, but if you think it's something besides fighting, just let us know what you think it is. Comment down below. Thanks. And thanks, Trail, for the hard work for the chicken catching. That's way better than the way they used to catch them about 50 years ago. Catch them with the hand? <laughs> yeah, with the hand. I could do it. I could have did that. Oh, uh, yeah, right. Because I did that. Uh, I did that to the same chicken and uh, I carried it over there, too. All right. And I chicken carriage over there. All right. So let's get in here and get some of our eggs out of here. So, bye-bye. See you later. <laughs>